believe that you already have everything that you need. You're not getting anything else. You have everything you need. The one you don't need money. See, oftentimes as I coach, as you know, as a sex coach, oftentimes we hire clients, and about 95% of the time they say the money is the problem. Right. And I believe by right now, remember, I think the game has changed. The flip, the, the script has been flipped. Yeah. Remember before back in the day when you had to pay to play? Yeah. Guess what? Now you ain't got to pay to play no more. All you have to do is simply play to play. That makes sense? It makes a lot of sense. Play to play. Yes, sir. And see, all you have to do is show up. And I believe that who shows up when you show up? Add value. Find what your unique selling proposition is. Absolutely. Yes, sir. What's your, what, what distinguishes you from everyone else? And I believe, as you know, um, entrepreneurship is about one thing. Find a need and fill it. Right now, with this global economy, um, people have needs. Yes, and so all you have to do is find a need and fill it. Be a solution to somebody's problem. Absolutely. And I believe that your money is on the other side of somebody else's problem. Mm. Oh, that's good, isn't it? Yes, sir. You don't need money. You need an idea. Dream big. Don't quit. And always continue to add value. Because I really believe in what I teach is that impact drives income. Gotcha. You see, when I impact your life, when I impact your business, my income goes up. Yes, sir. So many people, they, they try to put the car before the horse. And see, I believe that before your income can grow, your capacity has to grow. You know what I'm saying? I mean, before, before, before your compensation grows, your capacity has to grow. So also, I, I, I think I tell my clients, and I want to tell your, your clients is that commit to lifelong education. You know, hire a coach. Invest in yourself. I believe most people, they don't want to invest in themselves. And when you hire a coach or you read books or you go to seminars, it's not an expense, it's an investment. Right. Even Franklin said, once a man takes his, his uh, purse and dumps it into his head, no one can take it away. So as an entrepreneur, we have to be on the cutting edge of information. Because information costs, but it pays. And, and, and as a business owner, people are looking at you for information. You agree? Yes, sir. That's Absolutely. good stuff, man. Thank you for being with us, man. I appreciate so it. So thank you very much. I'll see you at the time. Don't meet me there. Beep me there. <laughs> Thanks a lot. Thank you.